Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Florentin and this will be my guitar one string challenge number three. If you haven't watched the first two challenges, I'll place uh, links of those at the bottom in the description. Uh, just a quick review. The first challenge looked like this, all on one string, using just the index finger in the third fret, fifth fret, seventh fret, with an open string in between. I'm playing on a nylon string on a classical, so I'm using a finger style uh, way of playing. You're welcome to use a pick if you play on a steel string, or if you prefer a pick on a classical, that's just fine. Uh, so this can work on any type of guitar. So this is challenge number one, just a quick review. And even though this is called a one string challenge, they are all movable so they can be done on any string. So you can do it on the second string. so on so you do it on any string really uh, but it's called a one string challenge because each individual pattern stays on the same string from beginning to end challenge number two simply added the second finger in the eighth fret so we have index in the third fifth seventh um, and eighth fret the eighth fret with the second finger so that, uh, and of course with an open string in between, so that challenge looked like this. And I'm playing each pattern three times before I land, uh, before I end it, before I land on the last note there. So one, one really I just landed on that uh, last note now this is uh, the third challenge challenge number three uh, I'm going to add the pinky in the tenth fret now I'll move my third finger out of the way a little bit so you can see the pattern there so we have one 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 two pinky now when you actually play this, don't get the finger down there. Keep it up like this. I'm just doing it so you can see the pattern there, okay? And it follows the same order, like this. So this is my guitar one string challenge number three. slow as you want but make sure that you keep a steady beat and also make sure that the two notes the fingered note and the open note are um, are not too different in sound don't make one louder than the other so okay so keep them even as much as possible so here it goes again my right hand I'm doing a walking motion there to get a nice decent speed happening uh, try not to play with just one finger I mean you could but that's just it's just too much work for just one finger so we use a walking motion there so like before this challenge works on all six strings so you should practice it at your own speed at first I mean at, at a slow speed at first slow comfortable speed and then gradually increase the speed and you should practice it on all the strings really even though it's called a one string challenge it does work on all the strings and the reason I call them a one string challenge is because each pattern stays on one string from beginning to the end so here goes my guitar one string challenge number three on all the strings Thank you. 
stop for little buzzes and little um, little um, missed notes like if your finger slips a little bit this is not a song so you don't have to stop and fix every single little mistake of course if everything sounds wrong you need to slow down and start over maybe but you shouldn't stop for every little buzz that's happening there okay the cool thing about this sort of um, uh, music is that you don't need the book for it it's not a song uh, all you need is really a guitar and um, easy to memorize, easy to warm up in the morning maybe, and just easy and, and very efficient for increasing your speed and your, your level of comfort on the instrument because it's going to cover uh, most of the frets eventually. All right, so that's my guitar one string challenge number three. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to write them at the bottom. If you're not yet subscribed to my channel, I invite you to subscribe. Thank you in advance for that. Don't forget to click that bell so you don't miss my uploads. Also, click that like button if you get a chance. I really appreciate that. And I hope to see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.